Next up, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use Photoshop's liquify command or liquify filter. I don't know if you've ever worked with this guy before. We can basically manipulate pixels as if they're, they're liquid. It's pretty cool. So I have my ice text layer selected inside the layers palette. I'm gonna head up to the filter menu and then look for liquify. There he is, right towards the top there. Go ahead and choose that guy. And we're gonna get a warning here. Photoshop says that our text layer must be rasterized before we can go any further. Is it okay to rasterize this text? I'm gonna say, yeah, that's fine. Go ahead and click on okay. And we wind up here inside the liquify dialog box. Now, what I'd like you to do is set a few options inside the dialog box before we get go in here. Make sure you have the first tool in the top left selected here, the forward warp tool. And then over on the right hand side, let's go and set some options here. I'm going to reduce down the size of my brush, maybe down to, oh, I don't know, maybe 100 or uh, maybe 150, something like that. Somewhere in there should be fine. And let's see, I'm going to set my brush density to 50 and my pressure maybe to about maybe about 70 or 75 something like that okay great now what winds up happening here is when i bring my cursor into this into this dialog box into the the main area of the dialog box anyway i can actually click and drag on the edges of my text here and as you can see i can actually push and pull the edges of my letters. It's almost like I'm finger painting with my with my text here, which is pretty cool. So what I wanna do is I wanna make it look like my letters are almost melting a little bit, right? So I wanna kinda pull in the edges here a little bit and you know, kinda do this, this kind of thing to it. And you can spend as much time on this as you want. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do this pretty quickly, but you can spend a little bit of time and kind of mess around with this a little bit. If you wanna create more detail, you can reduce down the size of your brush and, and so on. But I think here, what I'm gonna do is just kind of quickly go over the edges of my text, not even really being too careful or anything like this. So you know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave this up to you. Go ahead and finish manipulating your letters with the liquify command, and I'll catch up with you in just a moment and we'll continue on from where we've left off.